eventually. What's going on YouTube? It's Jose, aka KJ Lane Vision. I'm back with another video. And today, you know what it is. It's tea with me. Mmm. Gotta love the tea. This tea right here uh, is um, a black Earl Grey tea uh, mixed with a little bit of honey. Um, so far, it's been one of my favorite teas, the uh, Earl Grey. You should try it. If you're into tea, this is definitely a tea you should try out. Uh, if you're not into tea, it's probably still one of the first teas you should try out. Um, I wasn't really big into teas, but I really love this tea. So try it out. I got a, I have a monitor now. And so I'm so like, it's now I can actually see myself when I'm recording and I just got a habit of looking at that. Um, but today's question is, are you still going to full sale? Uh, a lot of questions have been getting asked of this just because, you know, some of my older full sale videos um, kind of uh, kind of getting more attention again. They, you know, they they get a lot of views and it stops and they get a lot of views and stops. Um, those are actually some of my biggest uh, content views is from my old full sale videos. Um, and so, yeah, I just want to answer the question. Um, do I still go to full sale and did full sale scam me twice? Um, yes, full sale scammed me twice, if you want to call it that. Uh, yes, I still go to full sale. I have three months, um, three months, three classes, however you want to call it. The classes are a month long. I am currently on a break um, until uh, the end of October, I believe. Then I'm going to go back in. Um, that's the nice thing about full sale because it is year round. Um, there is really no summer break. Summer breaks a week long. You go to school nonstop. Um, you can kind of take breaks when you want to. So you got to just contact the school and say, hey, after this class, can I take a break? Um, so I am getting my master's in business intelligence. Um, it was supposed to be a 12-month program, just month to month to month to month. But this is actually like my third break. I just got so much else going on in life. Um, these videos, creating content for you guys and stuff. And so sometimes I just need a break from doing all that in school and the businesses I'm trying to build and all those type of things. So I feel like um, taking a quick break from school, you know, whether it be a month, two months, or whatever it is, that's a lot easier for me. Um, so yeah, I'm on a break, but when I go back, I plan to knock out these last three classes uh, and be done. Um, so yeah, if you want to say full sell scam me for the people who think full sell is a scam, um, I just had a great conversation yesterday with some people on one of my full sell videos, which is kind of how this video came about. Um, um, and one person had a good point, like as far as people think, you know, one of the biggest complaints about people who go to full sell is that they go finish school and then they can't get a job. And people think that full sell um, is just a guaranteed job after you graduate and that's not the case um, and then the, the other complaint is you don't need to go to full sell to get a job in what you're going to full sell for and that's correct but that's almost any degree now almost every degree to a certain extent has become um, devalued um, degrees are not as valued as they used to be um, because the market as far as jobs is saturated, it's oversaturated. Like there's people everywhere looking for jobs who can do that, who got portfolios. Like if you go to school to be a graphic designer, but somebody learned how to do graphic design on their own and has an amazing portfolio and you're just fresh out with a graphic design degree. Yeah, that person is probably going to get the job over you. And that's because they already have an amazing portfolio that they put together without a degree. And of course, a job is probably going to want the person who's more experienced, who has that portfolio, over somebody who's fresh out of school, 
doesn't really have that portfolio yet, just has the things that they've created in school and it, it's just how it is. And then you go and blame the school. Oh, I don't have a degree. I got this degree and it's pointless. It's just, it's, it is what it is, man. Unless you're trying to go be a doctor, um, maybe a lawyer, a dentist, things like that. Like those are the only things that it's important to go get, to go to school. Everything else, almost everything else can pretty much be done without a degree. If you want to learn in a more structured area, uh, if you want to learn in a more structured area, more teacher-based, not 100% on your own, then yes, going to school is a better option for you. Um, if you want the degree for other purposes, like you don't really care about um, going to apply for that job that you got a degree and you just want a degree because there are some jobs out there that don't really care what your degree's in. They just want you to have a degree to get that position. Um, and so maybe that's why you go to school. You know, I've been offered promotions in my current job just because I have a degree and it's nothing related to what my degree's in, uh, which is sports marketing. Like it, it, it's not related at all um, working in the medical field because that's where I work, but I've been offered promotions just because I have a degree. So that might be the path you're trying to take. Um, I got a degree in sports marketing, wasn't 100% sure if I was gonna use it or not, um, and, and I'm not really using it. It's, I'm using some of the marketing techniques in um, just general marketing. Um, I guess you could say I'm using some of the sports marketing that I learned in uh, working with the Antelope Island Rugby Club that I'm now the marketing director for um, as a side position, not, not full time. Um, but that wasn't really the direction I was trying to go when I got this degree. I was just trying to have a degree to get those positions that require you to have a degree, get those promotions. Um, now I'm going to school for a master's in business intelligence, and I, I, my intentions are to use this degree. Uh, business intelligence is a, a uh, it's a huge field right now that is not oversaturated, um, so I'm planning on using it. So that's that. Excuse me one second. Um, but if, you, if you're a person who criticizes college or you criticize schools, especially Full Sail, I mean, I don't really know if you're criticizing it because you've actually experienced it or you've criticized it because you just hear the bad rumors. And there's bad rumors about any school. I mean, I originally went to a traditional college uh, many years ago um, here in Ogden, Utah. Um, and I will bash that school left and right. They still accuse me of owing them money because I got deployed and withdrew from class and they still want me to pay for those classes. And, um, and they've harassed me. I've, I've given them copies of the orders and it's still been a big issue for, for many years. And, and I'll bash that school left and right. And that was a tradition, traditional college, like a regular university. Um, and I would prefer full sell over them. Some people would prefer traditional college. Some people would prefer Stevens Henniger. Some people would prefer whatever. Like every school, there's different paths to the to the career you want to go to. There's many different there's many different paths you can get to that same position. You just got to decide what path is best for you, whether it be a traditional college, um, uh, a for profit school that many people don't like, like Full Sail, or learning on your own or going to YouTube University and building that portfolio or just being a freelancer and, and, and starting your own business. I mean, there's there's different ways. Not every way is best for everybody. And just because that way doesn't work for you doesn't mean you have to bash that way or, or tell other people that that's a bad way. No, that way might be good for them. Full sale might be good for some. It might not be good for many where the traditional university was not good for me. Um, but it's good for many people. Like traditional college is perfect for many people out there, you know? And there's certain people who are in my career that don't have a degree at all and, and have just learned, just building, just starting from the bottom and working their way up. I mean, hey, however it is, you get there. The only point at the end of the day is that you got there. So decide what's best for you. If you have any other questions specifically about Full Sail, um, let me know. I got my bachelor's from there. I'm getting my master's from there. Um, and I'm even thinking about possibly pursuing another degree from there. But, but after this, before I do that, um, 
my boy Justin Moody has convinced me to go get my real estate license, so I'm going to go to real estate school after this. Man, I love to learn, love education. I'm constantly reading and, and educating myself. Um, just like these videos, I never went to school for any of it. It's all just YouTube University um, and mentorships, you know, getting mentored from other content creators. So I love to, to learn. Um, so, yeah, that's it. Um, if you have any questions more about Full Sail, let me know. Um, if you have any questions, I don't really know about the on-campus uh, situation. I've never attended on-campus courses or things like that. But if you want to know about the online program, of many programs, I can answer those questions for you. Um, and remember, tea with me. Let's ask those questions. Let's get personal. Let's get business. Let's get whatever. I'll answer the questions 100% truthful. Um, so, yeah, stay tuned for many more teas with me. Try this tea out. It's very good. Other than that, um, yeah, I'm here to drop two videos a week. That's my goal, minimum two videos a week. I'm here. The office is ready. Everything's going. Um, possible new Lane Vision Media Arts headquarters coming real soon. Um, stay tuned for that tour um, when that happens. Um, stay tuned. I'm working with other businesses right now to help build them. Stay tuned for those coming. I got a lot in the works. Um, I always got a lot in the works. I wish I could tell you a lot of what's going on, um, but I can't. Um, but basically, new team, new content, new office, new, just new everything. And it's all coming together perfectly. Um, yeah, so stay tuned. See you there.